George is garbage! No, he had a good night. I don't think he's worth the money that he recently got, but hey, I mean, go get your money, man. Uh, so Paul George uh, plays against the Phoenix Suns, and they won the game. It was a close game, competitive game. There were some issues between him and Devin Booker, but I mean, Devin Booker's probably angry because he's been on a crappy team for so long, and he's been dedicated to the team, and uh, getting Chris Paul, yeah, it's nice, but are you really going to do something? Most likely not. But anyway, Paul George shot 15-24, 62% from the field, and he had 39 points. That's pretty flipping good. Seven threes. Seven out of ten. Seventy percent from three-point range. That, I'll give you credit. He had a couple rebounds, assists, blocked two steals. I mean, it's a productive night. Will you get it every night? You wish you could. Maybe not 40 points, but, you know, 20 to 25. But I don't think Paul George is that kind of player. He can... He can have a great night against some teams, and other teams, you just disappear. And the minutes are always up and down, and things of that nature, and I don't know. Paul George has always, has always been a good player, but I don't think he's been a necessarily great player. And I think people, and I think his contract states that he's part of that elite club, which he is definitely not. If anything, I think Kawhi Leonard should have got should be getting a contract like that. But I'm not saying he doesn't deserve a big contract. I just don't think he should get that kind of contract. But anyway, Paul George had a decent night. He scored well. He was involved in the game plan, and it seems like the that the Clippers are having a pretty decent season under new coaching with Ty Lue. And we'll see. I mean, I still think they're the team that can take out the. Los Angeles Lakers, but we'll see, I mean, and it depends on what Paul George does. He doesn't really play that well in the playoffs, and he kind of reminds me of a James Harden. You know, you can have a great regular season, but then when the playoffs start, you disappear. You flame out. You suck an egg. You disappear. You go into hiding, and you start building brick patios all over the city where you're playing at. You know, you can uh, work for a construction team because all you're doing is laying bricks. But I hope you guys enjoy the video, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.